Hi guys, it's Mark Zippy, Mr. Sci-Fi, also known as Mark Zippy of Space Command. And I am in the wonderful bucolic location of Anaheim, California at the Science Fiction Writers of America weekend in which they give out the esteemed Nebula Awards, one of the top two awards in science fiction, the other being the Hugo. So I've been meeting many, many writers uh, that I did not know before and running into ones that I did know before, like Robert Silverberg and my old uh, clarion teacher, Joe Haldeman, the great Joe Haldeman. And uh, so I'm having a good time and getting to know how things work in publishing now. And uh, it's an education and I'm having a, uh, it, it, it's interesting to have a weekend where I'm not uh, busy making Space Command. But, uh, but I wanted to comment on two uh, uh, things I saw recently that might be worth your time and trouble. One is the new TV series on Apple, uh, Silo, which is based on a series of books, the Wool series of books, and, uh, and a movie I just saw called The Artifice Girl that you can rent online. And um, neither is the most brilliant thing I've ever seen, but both have elements that make it uh, worth checking out. So let's start with The Artifice Girl. The basic idea, it's a low-budget science fiction film, but the basic idea is an intriguing one, which is creating a, an AI in the form of a young teen or preteen girl to lure pedophiles so they can be arrested. And it's, it covers several decades over which the AI uh, gains personality and, and uh, will and the ability to chart her own course. Yeah. And it's, it's really interesting. And uh, Lance Henriksen, it's broken into three sections. And Lance Henriksen is in the third, playing an older version of one of the younger characters. And uh, it's, it, I, I really enjoyed it. The actress who plays the, the AI is very, very good. And Lance, Lance, Henrik, Lance Henriksen is Lance Henriksen. So uh, I thought the idea the, was intriguing. So you might want to want to spend a few bucks and see that film, The Artifice Girl. And the other was Silo, which is a big budget uh, science fiction series starring Rebecca Ferguson, who is an actress that I thought was Irish, but it turns out she's Swedish, which is fine with me. But she was in Doctor Sleep as Maggie the Hat. She was terrific in that. And she also plays Paul Muadib's mother in uh, the Dune series of films, the recent Dune series of films. And she's just a really, really, really good actress. And in this, it takes place in a dystopic future where people live in a silo of hundreds of layer levels and uh, outside is supposedly fatal. And, uh, and, the, and the question is whether it actually is fatal or if they're being told a pack of lies for some insidious reason. The production values are very, very good. It's a little bit um, hermetically sealed. You know, it, in fact, like the third episode, the entire third episode is basically uh, Rebe Rebecca Ferguson trying to get the turbine to work. And, uh, you know, so it, uh, we'll see how it goes. But, uh, but I, so far I've, I've found it interesting enough and, uh, and the actors are very, very good. And the notion is intriguing, if not particularly fresh. So, um, so that's sort of the, the check-in for now. We're working on uh, Space Command. We're going to be shooting in the next couple of weeks. If you uh, have, um, you know, signed up to be an extra or have a bit role, let me, let us know. You can be on the alien spaceship, and uh, we will talk again real soon. Thanks a lot, guys. Take care.